ഹായ് ഗുഡ് മോർണിംഗ് മൈ ഡിയേഴ്സ് വെൽക്കം ബാക്ക് ടു അവർ ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് ടൈം ഡു യു റിമെമ്പർ അവർ ലാസ്റ്റ് ക്ലാസ് യെസ് വെരി ഗുഡ് ഹാവ് യു കംപ്ലീറ്റഡ് ഓൾ ദ ആക്ടിവിറ്റീസ് ആക്ടിവിറ്റി ഫൈവ് ആൻഡ് ദ ഡിസ്ക്രിപ്ഷൻ ഓക്കെ ഷോ മീ യുവർ നോട്ട് ബുക്ക് ഓക്കെ വെരി ഗുഡ് ഹൗ മെനി ഓഫ് യു റെഡ് ദ പാസേജ് ഓക്കെ യു ആർ വെരി ഗുഡ് ചിൽഡ്രൻ ചിൽഡ്രൻ ആർ യു ഹാപ്പി ഓക്കെ ഇഫ് യു ആർ ഹാപ്പി ദെൻ ക്ലാപ്പ് യുവർ ഹാൻഡ്സ് വൺ ടു വൺ ടു ത്രീ ചിൽഡ്രൻ ലുക്ക് അറ്റ് ദ സ്ക്രീൻ like the video okay very good dear you remember the story of the magic ring okay who is the hero of the story tell me who is the hero of the story yes you are correct abin abin is the hero of the story where is he now yes he is at the seashore he is waiting for his father children where is abin's father do you want to know more about his father okay check your textbook page number 72 shall we read it the passage teacher will read it for you you should read along with me a beautiful fish abin looked at the blue sea a small boat came riding on a big wave it's my father's boat abin jumped with joy the boat came ashore abin ran towards the boat there was a big fish in the boat what a huge fish how beautiful abin tried to lift the fish with both his hands We will take this fish to the market. We will sell it for a good price. Father said with a broad smile. Wait here. I will go and get a basket. Father said and walked away. Children, did Abin's father return? Yes. Abin's father returned with a huge, what? Huge fish. Okay. Okay. children our abin sat on the beautiful seashore that time a small boat came riding on a big wave children our abin is happy yes he is happy and he jumped with joy why yes he saw his father's boat then he ran towards the boat on the boat he saw a huge beautiful fish our little abin surprised because he never see such a beautiful and huge fish he tried to lift the fish both his hands his father also happy he said we will sell it in the market for a good price then abrabin's father 
said to Abin that, My little Abin, wait here. I will go and get a basket. Then he walked away. Children, are you ever been to the seashore? You may also visited other places such as park, forest, zoo, museum. Which is your favorite place? There is an activity for you. Look here. You can write your favorite place here. After that, you fill the word web here. Dear children, for example, if you want to write seashore or beach, which are the places you need to fill the bubbles? Tell me. Yes, waves. Then, seashell, sea sculpture, boats, like that. Then, if you want to write park, which are the places you need to fill the bubbles? Yes, swing, merry-go-round, slider, flowers, like that. Fill in the word web with more details. Your textbook, page number 87. You have to write a small description about the place. For example, your favorite place is park. You write like this. My favorite place is a park. There are many flowers and big trees in the park. I swing and slide in the park. I love to play with my friends in the park. Okay, dears, come back to our story. Our Abin is happy now? Yes, he is happy. Okay, take your text, page number 73, and read along with me. A relief. Abin looked at the fish. He had never seen such a large fish alive. Its silver belly gleamed in the sun. Its fins and tail were blue. It opened its mouth at regular intervals. It twisted and turned. Abin held it tight. The fish looked helplessly at Abin with its pink eyes. It was gasping for breath. Poor fish. I will let it go back to the sea. Poor fish, it will die soon. Abin felt sad. He walked towards the sea. A huge wave swept against Abin's feet. Suddenly, Abin let the fish into the sea. The fish happily glided through the waves. It went down into the deep blue sea and disappeared. Dear students, I hope you understood the passage. Read the passage individually and note down the new words and find out the meanings with the help of your dictionary. This passage tells us about fish. Its silver belly gleamed in the sun. Its fins and tail blue in color. Abin liked the fish. Do you like fish? Yes, our Abin liked the fish very much. The fish twisted and turned. Our Abin held it tightly. The fish gasping for breath. Look at the video. Here, some fishes. They 
open its mouth regularly they feel very difficult to breathe they twist and turn helplessly like this abins fish also gasping for breath Our Abin felt sad. He felt sympathy to the fish. He wanted to save the life of the fish. He walked towards the sea. A big wave came close to his feet. Suddenly, he let the fish into the sea. Both of them get relief from this difficult situation. our abin and the fish were now happy then what happened children after some time abin's father returned back then what happened let's see it in the next class bye